When you want to set up the brain plumbing inside your tree frog, just pull the cover off here. We're going to go ahead and start with the three quarter inch piece. Now this one's your massive overflow drain. It goes right here. This one also serves as the conduit to take your electrical cords out of here if you're running a fogger. Just run the electrical cord right down through that hole there down and out and route it away to your plug. Now you're going to have two different setups here if you have the intermediate kit. This one is the circulation side which would be on the 250 gallon per hour pump and basically just pick a side wherever you prefer to put it. I'm going to go ahead and put mine on this side and you'll notice at the bottom there there's a valve so you can adjust the flow on your circulation and your aeration pump. The next piece we're going to put in here is the flood nozzle and you can use this nozzle here for NFT or for flood or for recirculating deep water culture or river current. Go ahead and thread this one in and if you get the intermediate kit you'll have a 250 gallon per hour pump and a 400. We recommend you put the 400 gallon per hour on this assembly here. This one has a valve as well so you can regulate how much output flow you have. Then we're going to put in the drain pieces and as you're unpacking all your stuff here you'll probably notice these are drilled out here around the base so once those go down into that bulkhead fitting when the water floods down there it will drain completely so the tray gets completely dry. Go ahead and thread these into the drains on either side here. So with the drains you can adjust the height it's very simple, all you have to do is bend it to one side and your drain height can get lower or you can take pieces off uh, but just make sure that at the bottom of that drain you see that additional hole drilled in there. <laughs> 